if you inject presidential politics into some delicate negotiations, it's not necessarily constructive. Uh, and it's amazing how much people can get done when folks aren't worried about taking the credit uh, or passing the blame. Uh, I think we had seen some progress, and my hope is that we can build on this progress around four principles that I care deeply about in whatever uh, deal gets struck, that we have to make sure that there's strong oversight. I think that Secretary Paulson's acknowledged that. We have to make sure that taxpayers are treated like investors, that they're getting money back out of this deal that they're putting uh, at risk. Uh, I think there's some acknowledgement there. We all believe that CEOs should not be uh, walking away with golden parachutes coming out of this deal. I think there's some rough agreement there, and I think certainly on the Democratic side, we want to make sure that homeowners are getting some benefit from this plan in preventing foreclosures, making sure that communities uh, are sound. Senator, final question. You say you're going to show up at this debate uh, tomorrow night in Oxford, Mississippi. Uh, we're locked into a format, according to the Commission, of foreign policy. Are you going to raise the economy as a topic anyway? You know, with, with this looming in the horizon, this has an effect all across the globe. Uh, and one of the arguments that I've consistently made in this campaign is we can't be strong abroad if we're not strong at home. Uh, if we are spending $10 billion a month in Iraq, when they have a $79 billion surplus, at a time when we are not just looking at record deficits, but we now have this extraordinary crisis uh, in our financial markets, uh, that just does not uh, make for a safe and secure America. It's one of the fundamental differences that uh, I have with John McCain, and it's something that I think we need to explore in a debate format. Uh, you know, we're only talking about 90 minutes here, uh, I think that a president uh, has to be able to do more than one thing at a time, and I think for us to explain our vision for where we want to take the country to the American people, particularly at this time uh, of difficulty, is, is especially important. So I hope uh, John McCain shows up. Senator, thank you for your patience. Happy trails, safe travels. Thank